Hey guys, today I wanted to um, come to you with a Vox Box review um, that's through influencer.com and basically um, random people on the site are chosen based on how many influence points they have to receive a free Vox Box in the mail and it contains products that they'd like you to look at and review. I'm not being paid for these reviews, however, the items were given to me, but I'm giving my honest um, opinion of what I think of them. I've been using them for about a week. Um, this last one that came out was an Herbal Essences Naked Vox Box. This is what it looked like. That's the box and little card that tells you about it. I'm sorry, I just have a picture. Um, and then what they sent were travel sized. This is the first product. It's the Naked Herbal Essences Naked Moisture Conditioner. And it's 0% um, paraben free. It's supposed to be all good stuff. And, and they also gave the shampoo. And as you can see, I've been using these. There's not very much left at all. And then they gave a full size of the Herbal Essences Dry Shampoo. Um, that's also naked, but it's, it doesn't say doesn't say the moisture like the um, shampoo and conditioner do. Um, but this is the full size product. Like I said, I've been using these two for about a week. Um, that's why they're almost gone. I've been using them every day, um, but I've used them enough to have an honest review about them. And then the dry shampoo, I only um, use twice. I don't really use dry shampoo. Um, I'm gonna start with this actually because I've tried like three or four um, dry shampoos. I've used Dove before, it's okay. This is really nice. You spray it in, it smells clean. Um, that's about it, just clean. It doesn't have any color to it. I didn't have any white in my hair, it wasn't chalky. Um, I didn't have to brush it through, of course I did, but if I had just sprayed it on, you wouldn't have seen it in my hair. Um, so I was able to brush it through, comb it through, whatever. My hair definitely felt um, clean. It had more volume to it. It didn't feel like I had anything in it, which I found with other dry shampoos. It feels like you have something cakey on your scalp sometimes. But um, I would recommend this for if you're gonna use a dry shampoo. I just don't really use them all that much, but I thought this was a good one, best one I've tried. Then the shampoo, um, I like the Herbal Essences anyway, but this stuff's really nice. Um, it, it definitely cleans, it lathers really well. You don't need a lot of it, but um, it didn't have any like residue on your scalp. It didn't, I don't know, there was nothing negative to say, but it just felt clean. It didn't feel like you had a lot of product on even though it lathered really well and then it rinsed out and your hair just felt like it was wet. It didn't feel like it had anything left in it, um, which is good. The water pressure at my boyfriend's house is not that great. And um, I've been using this over there mostly and it's still, even with the lack of water pressure from the showers, my scalp still feels clean with this. It doesn't feel like anything's left behind. And then the conditioner um, is exciting to me because I have kind of dry hair. I do bleach it. You can see my roots I need to have touched up. I'm not a natural blonde, but I like to be blonde. So my hair's a little bit dry from bleaching. This conditioner is really creamy, which a lot of the time when you're, a conditioner feels creamy to your hand, it's gonna leave residue or make your scalp feel oily. Um, this definitely when you're putting it in is a concern. It goes through really well. It's soft, instantly detangles your hair. Um, I really like it, but then it washes out and there's no residue, there's nothing um, there, your scalp doesn't feel oily. When I get out I still have some volume, some lift um, up there, and it just, it really softens and conditions my hair, makes it smell really good. I don't know if you can see, but it gives it a very nice shine. My hair can be dull sometimes, but this conditioner really makes it nice. Um, so basically, I highly recommend all three of these products that I was sent. A dry shampoo. I'm probably never going to get through the whole thing just because I don't really use dry shampoo. But the shampoo and conditioner, you know this is an honest review and that I really like both of them because I already went out and bought the two full-size products yesterday. Um, I went to Walmart. I forget how much these cost. I want to say they were like in the 250 range maybe, 350 I don't know. They're not that expensive. Um, I usually use expensive shampoos and conditioners. Um, I've tried all different kinds because I have an oily scalp and dry hair, which is a horrible combination. Um, but this, I really like these, I'm going to be using them. So that is my review. Hopefully it was helpful. I would recommend going and buying those. Um, it's a nice, easily accessible line since it's at Target, Walmart, Walgreens, everyone has herbal essences and it works really well. Um, this naked line, what else is great about it? Let's see. It's paraben free, but I don't think it's supposed to have, it doesn't have any like color to it, dyes. Obviously it has some scent to it. It has, um, it's herbal mint fusion extracts, but I would recommend it. 
that's my review. Again, this was sent to me. It's Voxbox through Influencer.com. That's a site you can just um, sign up. You review products. If you are active enough on the site, they choose you randomly to take like a survey to see if you qualify for the Voxbox that they're currently doing. And that is what I did to qualify for this. And then you're supposed to, you know, go on your social media, share it on Instagram, YouTube. That's what I'm doing. So again, I was not paid, but I was sent these products for free. This is my honest review, which is why we went from a free little travel size to I went out and spent my own money and got the full size. Very good products. If you have any questions, feel free to ask them down in the comments below, or if you just want to comment on my review or you'd like to see more of these reviews. Also remember to follow me on Instagram at to be fetching two, like the number. <laughs> um, and then also on Twitter, to be fetching, and here on YouTube, to be fetching.